Hi, this is Andy Filippiak in Toronto for the week of March the 11th. The global economy continues to weaken. Last week we saw statistics out of Europe where growth forecasts for 2019 in the Eurozone are now down from 1.7% annual growth to 1.1% growth. I've never seen such a sharp revision over a short period of time. As well, in Canada last week, we saw the Bank of Canada come completely clean stating that the Canadian economy is slowing and that we will likely see weaker growth in the second half of 2019 from what we're seeing now. I mean, this is a big change from what we were hearing just six months ago. There's, there's no doubt that in Canada, these interest rate hikes that we've seen over the last couple of years are now starting to filter into the real economy. For example, Vancouver real estate is now dropping, well, rather precipitously as volumes have you know, seized up and prices are coming down. Toronto's not that much farther behind. I've included the yield curve for both Canada and the US. <clears throat> if you look closely at it, we are now inverted both in Canada and the US from overnight rates out to five years. Now an inverted yield curve is the bond market's way of saying a recession or a real economic slowdown is just on the horizon. So with an inverted yield curve now in both countries, this is getting very, very concerning because the bond market is one of the best indicators and by buying bonds, you're basically taking a lower interest rate because you're not afraid of inflation going out. So this bears watching. Thanks for watching.